Hello students, my name is Sumit Mehta. Today in this lecture we will discuss about right angle triangle and Pythagoras property. So student, I have told you earlier also what is right angle triangle. Okay, and I am drawing here one of right angle triangle. Okay, which is right angle on B. Right angle triangle is that triangle in which uh, one angle is 90 degrees. So in this triangle I have taken angle B equal 90 degree. Okay, so this is 90 degree and this is called as right angle triangle. Okay, and so the side opposite to right angle triangle AC is side opposite to right angle triangle so it is called as hypotenuse okay students so we can call AC as hypotenuse of this triangle which is opposite to the right angle okay because you can see directly from the figure that this side is opposite to this angle okay so we can call this AC as hypotenuse so student based on Pythagoras property Pythagoras property I can directly write AC square is equals to AB square plus BC square means the square of the hypotenuse is equals to the square of sum of the sum of square of two sides but this property states that the square of hypotenuse is equal to equal to sum of squares of two other sides okay so i hope students you are pretty clear about what is pythagoras theorem okay let me give you some example based on this and i hope that if some question comes into exam on this property you guys can easily solve this question let me give you some question okay so student this is a question in which it states that abc is right angle triangle at c so as you can see from the figure that this is a 90 degree angle and if ac equal 5 and we are given the value of ac and bc also 12 cm and we have to find the length ab which is a hypotenuse so can i write ab square is equals to ac square plus bc square in bracket using pythagoras theorem it states that hypotenuse square is equals to square of sum of square of two sides okay and i have to find out ab so putting the value of AC and BC in the equation what I will get AB is equals to 25 plus 1 double 4 so AB square is coming out to be 169 so AB is coming out to be 13 centimeter ok students I hope you guys are pretty clear about how to solve the question based on Pythagoras theorem and if you have still any doubt or any question based on this or or in the lecture which I have told you about the property of hypotenuse triangle means Pythagoras property okay and if you have still any doubt then please do comment in the comment section students I will be happy to help you guys there thank you students happy learning